Um, I'm motivated every night. Uh, I know that um, I just, uh, coach kind of told me I'm back in the starting lineup, so I just, you know, knowing I'm going to play a little more minutes, I just wanted to uh, try to execute and do as much as I can to help the team win. How much chatter did you hear this week after kind of some of the stuff that came up last Monday? Uh, about? In regards to what, what Frank Rochelle said about you on ESPN? Uh, very false. Um, I'm a, a very realistic person, and uh, I'm, I'm here to play for K-State, here to win games, and that's, that's, that's my goal. And uh, right now we're not winning, and I know, I know what it takes to get to that next level, and, and winning is one of them. So I, I'm, I, I got to win some games, and that's what my focus is on right now. How difficult, if at all, was it for you to come off the bench for a little while, you know, during going into the season, which was expected of you and this team? Um, um, I would say, you know, that's 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 coaching. I mean, they they you know they, they either play me or not. You mean play me however they want to do. That's that's up to them. I do I try to do my job, and that's uh, <clears throat> you know try to execute and, and do what I can. I know that uh, for those games that I was sitting on the bench, I think between those, I think I averaged damn near the same amount right. I did. I mean, not not off the bench. So I mean, it was I tried to you know do do try to do my job in a, in, in a little amount of minutes. I mean, in a less amount of minutes. So that was just my goal and. And that's really it. And really just trying to win games. Uh, it's, it's really tough. We're, we're so close. Uh, it's really coming down to one possession. We just got to execute and, and, and dominate those. And that's really it. So right now we're just we're going to watch film, of course, see what we what we did and what we could have did better, and then uh, get ready for Okie State and uh, get look for, forward to winning against them. Sorry, this is one of your more efficient games. At least it seemed that way, like on the stat line. What do you think you did just a little bit better? Um, <clears throat> just staying confident. Uh, no, I missed my first three. Um, and I do know that I, you know, I continue to work on my jump shot all the time. Before the games, it feels amazing. Uh, so I just kept shooting and I uh, was making some shots. Drove it at certain times, got to the free throw line. Uh, I think I missed two free throws, so I mean, I wish I made those ones. But uh, other than that, I feel like, you know, I just try to stay aggressive. I feel like I should have been a, lot, a little bit more aggressive, you know, uh, but it is what it is. Got to go back and go to the drawing boards and hopefully next game I, I come out a lot better than this one. So just every day trying to get better. What have you had to do um, as, as a leader to just kind of keep everybody's heads up during this tough stretch? I'm just letting them know. Uh, I've seen this before. Uh, my first year here when I was red shirt, it was really tough, and we and we made a run. And then just knowing that it's still very, it's still very a lot of more opportunities uh, to to make it to the tournament. Big 12 championship, um, Big 12 tournament is a, is, a, is a great example. Iowa State did it last year. They, uh, they, they won it and got into the tournament. So it's just, you know, just keeping my guys focused and understanding how close we are to those teams that's in our conference and knowing that we still have a chance regardless of, you know, how we finish off the season. I mean, in, in, I mean, in the conference thing, we can still, you know, make a chance in the tournament. But we're not looking forward to that right now. We're, we're, we're focused on Oak State. What's it going to take to break the cycle and win one of these games when you're close? Uh, a great start. Uh, the one that we did win against West V, we started off amazing. Uh, and, and that's the biggest thing I believe for us is that we, we're good at coming back, but we shouldn't be coming back. You know, I mean, those, those points should be us taking the lead or something like that. So I think that's that's the biggest thing. We definitely we definitely uh, continue to fight regardless of you know the score, and, and, and we bring it back. But we got to execute when it's when it's a two point game or you know a five point game. Those those are really crucial, and, and we just got to get better at that. And I think I think that we are going to get better at that, and hopefully we show in Okie State. When a game like tonight starts, do you feel like you have energy that matches theirs, or is that part of the issue that's perhaps causing, you know, these starts for you guys? Well, I, I definitely think we have energy that matches it. Today we, we started with four straight turnovers, I believe, so that was that was huge. And led to them transition. Uh, Samuel, uh, I mean, uh, Solomon Young, he did a great job. He got 11 points in, in five minutes. So probably his, 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 uh, his fastest ever getting that many points. I think he had to finish over 20, so, you know, he played really good, and that was just... We just gotta, we gotta do better. We had to do better at you know stopping him and leaving him early. Like I said, I think they started off 22 to six, maybe 22 to five, four, whatever like that. So it was just like early, early uh, start off, and and I was just I felt like that that affected the game for the rest of it.